welcome. This short film has been produced to give healthcare professionals information on how to measure, plot and interpret growth in infants and toddlers. The film was recorded at Sheffield Children's Hospital and features myself, Dr Robert Coombs, a consultant neonatologist, and my colleague Sally Carney, an endocrine nurse specialist. To view the supporting information and exercises relating to growth and to find more information on the forum, please visit www.infantandtoddlerforum.org. Sally, why do you think it's so important to measure growth? Measurement of growth in terms of um, length or height or weight is the most non-invasive method of assessing a child's well-being. Measurement of growth in childhood is very important for us to recognise any deviations in height, length or weight. Plotting these measurements on growth charts gives us a clear understanding if children are falling away or going above the centiles. The other useful thing that we can do with height and weight is calculate a body mass index, which actually will check for children's obesity. And how often should children have their height and weight measured? Measurements can be taken um, when the children visit the GP surgery for immunisations or routine health checks. So this should be at 2, 3, 4, 8 and 12 months? Are there any other opportunities to do this? Not necessarily. If parents are concerned and are airing concerns to you, then that should be a, a sort of warning alarm to actually do a height and weight. Also, you should always ask yourself as a health professional, is this face-to-face -face encounter with a child an opportunity to take a height and a weight at that time? As you know, all school children do have a height and weight measured on school entry. Should it be more often than this, Sally? In children over a year of age, no more than three monthly intervals is necessary. The more measurements you do, Below that, you will actually start to introduce error into measurement because of fluctuations in, in weight and height. Particularly in babies, um, you know, milk feed can, can add 200 grams to a weight if they're fed pre-measurement.